This is lesson 68 in our free Code Camp's basic JavaScript section. We're going over introducing else if statements. So if you have multiple conditions that need to be addressed, you can chain if statements together with else if statements. And here's the example to give us. We check if num is greater than 15. We re return bigger than 15. If not, then it does this else if. So then it checks if num is less than 5. If it is, it will return smaller than 5. And then else. So if both of these are false, then it will just return between 5 and 15. Instructions convert the logic to use else if statements. So you should have at least two else statements. Let's see. Convert the logic to use else if statements. So all we really have to do, since it's already kind of done for us, is add else if right here. So else if and here we would just say else. And put this also actually should work. Could do a that. So let's just uh, check our logic test else if seven. So if seven is passed into val, seven is greater than ten would be false. It would not run this. Then it would come over here, 7 less than 5. It would not run this either because it's also false. So it would say between 5 and 10. And it would return that between 5 and 10. If we do something like uh, 25, 25 put in here, 25 is greater than 10. So it will say greater than 10. If we do 2, this first one is false. Then it will go to our else if to less than 5, it will say smaller than 5. So that pretty much makes sense. So it should be it for this lesson.